Why aren't Oko moves banned in competitive Pokemon? While in singles metagames, Oko moves are banned, in the official competitive format known as VGC, you're free to spam as many sheer colds, fissures, or horn drills as your heart desires. Well, the short answer is that Oko moves are bad. And the less short answer is that with a flat 30% accuracy that can't be changed by accuracy boosts or evasion drops, Oko moves' biggest downside is having to run them over a better strategy. Oko moves may provide the biggest reward possible in Pokemon short of just winning the whole game, but when you have a 70% chance of just doing nothing, they don't provide too much value if you want to win. That being said, there are some niche use cases for Oko moves like in 2017 when Gastrodon used Fissure due to losing Earth Power, along with having it give it a really strong Tectonic Rage. Or in 2020 when Lapras would use Sheer Cold to get the strongest possible G-Max Resonance. Other Pokemon would also occasionally tech on Oko moves in case the team's dedicated Dondozo or Garganical answer failed. They mostly just see usage as last-ditch efforts to try to sneak in a win, so when new players see them, they get kinda confused and ask, 